Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello winners, welcome back to our channel Firstly, I want to say thank you for you for your loyalty watching videos on this channel and I want to say also congratulations for our channel that has reached more than 100 subscribers Alright, congratulations Okay, in this video, in this e-learning video we would like to study together about pronunciation Pronunciation is the most important of speaking and understanding a language specifically in English because in learning English I'm sure you are familiar with this aspect because pronunciation is relating with the phonetic skills phonetic skills are ignored by many English learners pronunciation is as important as for instance listening and conversational skills with a good pronunciation we will be able to avoid misunderstanding whether if we are as the speaker or we are as the listener all right in this video i am going to explain it by using the material from don't stream books with the title pronunciation illustrated drawing by peter nibon i want to explain seven pages for this video they are page 16 19 21 29 38 39 and 51 all right don't go anywhere take this video Alright, this is the material that we will be discussing for this video and this is the first page, uh, I mean the first section for this learning. I chose the page 16 for our introduction. We would like to pronunciate between E and E. So in English, intonation can affect the meaning of the word. We can see in the first picture of this page, there are Sheeps and ships. All right. For example, I have two ships in the park, and then Titanic ships is the biggest ships in the world. You can see the difference between them. There are bean and bin. Do you know how to pronounce well? How to differentiate among them? All right. The first is bean with the e and a in the middle of word so the intonation is longer than bin bean i have many beans in my refrigerator and then bin for example what's my files do you send them to the recycle bin all right we move to the next picture there are meal and mail you can hear the difference between meal and mill. Meal, for example, I have a meal for my lunch. Okay. Next, mill. There are so many mill in the Netherlands. All right. Do you hear the differentiate? Yes. The intonation is a fact. The word. It's a fact. The meaning of word. Okay. We are going to the next picture. The difference between lead and lit we cannot say lit for example the leader no the correct one is the leader for example lead the leader of our group will be presenting our works and then lit for example there are some foods behind that lid so lit is like has the same meaning with the cover or cap lit lead and lead all right in the next picture we will be differentiating between gin and gin gin is the alcoholic drinks from fruit fermentation okay all right gin drinks gin do you hear the difference the difference between them uh, beside this clause there are we can say there is but gin doesn't like gin all right, we move to the another picture, another example. Okay, sleepy, sleepy, sleep, sleep, sleepy, Friday, Friday, not Friday, Friday, sleepy, Friday, six, 
size. Six size. Six size is different with six. Six is different with six. So six size. Six size. And then six slivers. Okay. Six slivers. And then the the other the other sentence to fit her feet to fit her feet and then the next picture the last picture on this page fish fish and then chips and chips are cheap are cheap easy to eat and easy to eat all right and easy to eat all right we move to the next page page 19 okay in this page we will be able to differentiate between a and a okay we look we are looking for the first picture in this picture we differentiate between a pet and a pet pet and a pet so it's not intonation again but like the difference uh, for, uh tongue when we pronounce it pet and pet a pet for example i have many pets in my house and then a pet for example i have three pets in this stage we are going to the next picture difference between men and men okay the first one man one man so it's like there are a there are a and a in the middle of this word one man one man one man for example there is one man in my bedroom for the other example like that man is playing football and then many men for example many men line up facing me and then a net with a net net is different with a net you can see in, the, in this picture net for example network we cannot say network like network but network not 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 is similar with mosquito next picture we will be seeing the difference between pedaling and paddling so in the word of pedaling we can stress we can stress uh, the first syllable of this word pedaling pedaling the next and then the next word is paddling we also be uh, we will also be able to pronounce it uh, with uh, like uh, sounds a and a in the middle of this word uh, between p and d paddling and then in the next picture there are pet and then has that hat on his hat pet has that hat on his head and then in the next picture there are three people Jack has a check Jack has a check and then cap 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 in his hand in his hand Jack's Jack friend Jack's Jack friend friends French French is a very expensive it's a very expensive French friend friend French friends friend Francis French friend because yes, there is a stroke as so French friends friend is a very expensive next this is a page 21 okay in the next page we will be able to differentiate between a and a for example in this first picture hat with hat for example i have two hats in my house or may i borrow your hat and then for a hat for example there is a hat in the middle of the forest and then we are going to the next picture the difference between a battler and a butler battler battler and then the next picture there are stamp and stamp there are a banker 
and bank banker bank banker bunker and then the next picture there is a sentence these windows were shattered and then beside these windows were shattered shattered shut 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 and shut shattered shattered and the next the final picture of this page there are mashed potatoes with butter mashed potatoes with butter butter and then beside it there is a mashed potatoes with batter 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 bat bat batter we are going to the next page this is page 29 we would like to pronounce U. For example, in the first picture, we can see butcher and a cook. So it's like the first page. It's about the intonation of the middle of the word. Butcher. A cook. Beside it, there are bull and a rook. Rook. Bull. Rook. Bull. Rook. And then the next picture, there is a sentence. In this picture, it is actually how to pronounce double O. So, if, if we find there there is a double O in the middle of word, so we can say it with a long O. For example, the cook looks at a cookery book. She puts some sugar in the pudding. Under the next picture, there is a sentence, the pudding looks good. The pudding looks good. Look, with a long U. Look. And then the next word, there is at look. At look. 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 So, in this context, in this word, we can say with the short U. Look. Look. And the next, the next sentence, pulling poor full so if we say poor it with uh, it is with a long u pulling a poor full out of the pool in the wood in the wood wood in the wood is foolish bookish a joke is foolish bookish a joke too full is too full good foot of good foot of good foot to move to move a foot a foot okay in the next picture we are going to differentiate between a and i how to pronounce a and i look at the context look at the first picture to lay to lay and then to lie to lie in the next picture there is a pain a pain and then a pine a pine and then the next picture there are uh, there are height and height 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 and then the next picture there is a sentence the lake that i like the lake that i like and in the next picture, there is a sentence also. David baits his hook. David baits his hook. David baits his hook. And in the last picture, and a whiting bites it. And a whiting bites it. Alright, we are going to the next page. This is a page 39. Okay, in this page, we are going to differentiate between pronunciation of A and oi oi it oi usually we use when there is a word that o needs i or o needs y for example this picture good boys good boys and then goodbyes goodbyes and then the next picture there are four things in this picture a coin a pine, a pine, a pine, a foil, a foil, a file. And in the next picture, there are two sentences. 
and the first sentence is Joyce walks off his poise. Joyce walks off his poise. Giles walks off with eyes. Okay, Mainers, that's all from e learning in this video. I hope this video can be useful for you, improve your knowledge about pronunciation. If I have something wrong to say, I want to apologize and I hope you forgive me. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.